If you guys don't know Plus by now, you better. These sell like hotcakes, the Plus Kaite Slate. This is currently the only alternative to e-paper in a white form. A lot of the other magnet boards, in fact all of the other magnet boards, just use that kind of magnetic boogie board style of screen. This one actually goes as far as to have individual little micro capsules filled with little particles of circular magnet bits. And when you have a positive charge with the magnet, the particles go up and create an image. Exactly the same way electronic ink aka e-ink works, except this uses a magnet via your hand to power it, whereas an e-reader or an e-ink device is electronically controlled. They're the same concept, and today they've sent us two new products. These are the Kaite Memo Pads. They are both different sizes. This one is a 90 by 90 and this one is an A4, but only one third of the size of an A4. And if you know Plus, these guys have multiple different layouts. They have grid, they have clean, they have A4, they have A5, 13.3s, 10.3s, etc. So they have a lot of stuff. Let's go ahead and open these up and unbox them and look at them and do a full review all in one because these are pretty simplistic. I mean, they're, they are what they are. They're just little memo pads. So we are going to open this up and we'll translate a couple things here. It basically says no consumables required. So you don't need to rip off paper each and every time. And this also says there's no ink, there's no batteries, you can just erase it, waterproof is okay. And you know what was surprising? Oh, look at that! Cool! They give you a little eraser, I think. Oh, that's kind of nice, a little scrubber eraser, and the pen. And if you're wondering if you need this pen, you don't. Because this is a Plus Corporation item, you can actually use any one of their pens all the way from their normal pens to the medium ones as well. This is considered the medium pen, as you see right there they all work. So I'm going to use this scrubber because that's really cool. Let's see if that erases. It does. That's so nice. Now the thing about it, if you're skipping through this video, the thing about these is that they don't have that black boogie board style look to it. And you know, I've used those and they just, they don't feel very good to use. They're just this weird kind of rainbow swiping. It's a lot of bleeding. It's not as accurate and clean as these units. In fact, the second gen unit is called the Kaite 2S Clean. It's actually called that. So look at all these little things you have. You have an eraser and I think the eraser bolts onto the side there. It does. That's really cool. You get a lapel clip. Now to be honest, this isn't a very impressive pen. I would recommend actually using their main pen because this looks like those little throwaway pens you get at the golf course. They're not very nice. They're just very kind of normal. But you know what surprised me is that these are flexible. I didn't know these were flexible when they sent us their initial email saying they had new products for us. These are actually flexible. So that's interesting that they're made out of this kind of silicone material. They don't roll. I mean, they probably could, but you would damage the actual mechanisms of how the magnetics work if you maybe pinch it or fold it. So I wouldn't recommend that, but it definitely is forgiving that you can kind of have it all floppy like that. We'll just go ahead and do some just light note taking because again, this is not a very in-depth video. Peter is using the new Kaite Memo. The thing about these guys is that it's as white on black as any magnet board you will find. No other magnet board actually works like this. Yes, you would get the same thing out of a dry erase, but that's not the problem. You're not using consumables. A dry erase pen will go away. Your dry erase scrubber that you have on your fridge for when your kids go to school and stuff, that's going to get dirty. None of this does. This actually doesn't get dirty and you can just erase and erase and erase. And if you were to get different pens, they'll have erasers on them. You can use the gigantic Kaite 35 inch roller if you want. This thing is really cool. You just scrub away like that. It's kind of that Zen garden-y type thing where you have to kind of line up all the magnetic particles again, as you can see right here, in order to clean it. But once you do, you just get right back to 
writing. This is really interesting because Plus has existed in the background for quite some time. They are not a player in the e-reader world, but they currently are the only manufacturer that utilizes technology similar to e-ink that requires no batteries. You guys might argue that it is an over-glorified magnet board, but when you break everything down in the magnet board game, these guys are king. They are king. These aren't the throwaway dollar store ones you get that are just black and green and purple and just colors you don't want to see. Furthermore, once you have your notes taken on a page, you can actually save your notes. Now you might be wondering how is that possible because this isn't an electronic device. Well, you actually have to use your phone with the Kaite app installed. Once you install the app, you simply just hover it over the Kaite screen and you don't even have to press the actual camera button. It will actually pull all of the things you wrote onto here from the app. And from here, you can change things like the overall boldness and the contrast and you can crop it and you can basically do whatever you want from here and then you can save it you can add things to it you can draw on it does this update the kaite device quote, quote unquote no because there's no link this is a non-electronic goods so you cannot do that but anything you write on here you can save on here and instantly share it save it to this device send it via other apps send it to whoever you want via Facebook and Instagram and whoever you want so there's a level of usability with these now the last thing we're gonna mention before we wrap up this is considered non-DG. DG stands for dangerous goods. If you want a simple note-taking like even the Kakumiru, which is a four-inch note-taking e-ink panel, that has batteries, that has lithium-ion. These don't. So the reason these are such usable products in up-and-coming markets and up-and-coming countries and underdeveloped countries is because they don't use any battery whatsoever. People have smartphones in just about every country in the world from their local dealers, but getting e-readers over to India and Brazil and Chile and all these other countries, it's not easy. So things like this, there's a time and a place and a use case on this planet for these. And it's very interesting that Kaite is expanding their portfolio into miniature memo pads. For GoodyReader.com, this is Peter.